from the top floor of Manio High School, live on tape, it's Manio Today with Kelsey Sexton and Kyle Logan. Good morning, today is Friday, March 9th, 2018. I'm Kelsey Sexton. And I'm Warren Brown with Manio Today. Would you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now, a moment of silence. Good things are happening here at MHS. Ms. Holland's Honors Anatomy and Physiology students articulated the entire human skeleton. The class was split into eight groups, and each group was given 11 minutes to complete the whole skeleton. This week, students in Ms. Sumrall's Spanish I class joined students in Ms. Cecil's first period class to learn about different cultures for National Foreign Language Week. Mrs. Cecil's students, who are fluent in Spanish, and Ms. Sumrall's students interviewed each other and will give a presentation to the class about their findings later this week. This week, students in Ms. Thomas's AP Literature class acted out a pivotal scene from King Lear. The Duke of Cornwall, played by Lauren Woody, gouges out the Earl of Gloucester's, played by Valentino Kudelkova, eyes while Cornwall's wife, Reagan, played by Hannah Schumann, watches in glee. Afterwards, a servant, played by Logan Cecil, boldly tries to defend the Earl against further attacks from Cornwall. The scene epitomizes the idea that physical blindness leads to deep mental insight, but that realization comes too late for Gloucester. Sophomore students in Mr. Cleaver's AVID class participate in debates as part of a mock presidential campaign project. AP English language students in Ms. Pritchard's first period use the philosophical chairs format to debate the 2014 Free Response 3 question. The prompt asks students to determine the meaning of creativity and to decide whether or not a creative thinking class should be offered to students. To support their viewpoints, students had to provide research and or personal experience. The National Honor Society will be sponsoring a blood drive on Wednesday in the gym. See a member to schedule a time to give blood. Look guys, I found this cool flyer for the spelling bee. It says that we can each win a $20 gift card and Ooh. bee hats and major bragging rights. Oh. For your team to qualify, you must have four members. One, two, three, four. Each team gets three balloons. If your team gets a word wrong, your balloon gets popped. The next word is globophobia. C L O B O O B P H O. Is that right? Is that right? Is that your final answer? Yes. 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 The team with the most balloons at the end wins. Consult your team in a quiet manner. The word is honeycomb. I okay. wonder what it could be. <laughs> so, so H. I'm sure it at least o starts with an H. N E Y C O M B. Yeah, that's okay. Do not be loud. Okay, your word is convergent. Warren, how do you think you spell that? C <laughs> O N V. You fool. E <laughs> the other team heard us. The use of electronics is considered cheating. I got it. Good idea. Dakota, you have to use this, not that. Oh, man. Come out to the spelling bee on March 15th at 4 p.m. in the Media Center. Well, finally, it looks like we will have a nice sunny weekend, but with chilly temperatures. Looking at our current temperatures around the area, 40 degrees here in Manio and 33 up in Currituck. So for today, sunny with a high near 50. It will be breezy. Tonight, mostly clear with a low around 33. Tomorrow, mostly sunny with a high around 52. Saturday, night cloudy. Don't forget to move your clocks ahead one hour as daylight saving time begins. By Sunday, there is a chance of showers and a high of only 49. Monday, partly cloudy and a high of 49. That's your weekend weather. Congratulations to Eric Williams, who was selected this past weekend through audition to participate in both the All-State Jazz Band and All-State Concert Band this spring. 
This is National Foreign Language Week. Here's our news correspondent, Leslie Estrada. Languages lead us on a path to understanding other cultures. Students in Ms. Cecil's and Sumrall's first and fifth period classes will be interviewing this week people that speak another language and will be making a presentation to share with their classes at the end of the week. A few famous Hispanic athletes are Roberto Clemente, was born in Puerto Rico and played professional baseball for the Pittsburgh Pirates. He was the first Latin American to enter the Baseball Hall of Fame. Juan Pablo Montoya is a Colombian-born race car driver who raced Formula One cars and currently drives on the NASCAR circuit. Chichi Rodriguez was the first Puerto Rican inducted into the Golf Hall of Fame. He helps to raise money for underprivileged children from broken homes. Good morning, I'm Janae Julian with your MHS Sports. We here at Manio today would like to apologize to our varsity baseball players and Coach Wheeler for having the wrong score listed for the first flight Manio game yesterday. Our Redskins did beat the Nighthawks and would like to congratulate them on their big win, 6-1. to one. Again, we apologize for this unfortunate error. There was a lot of sports action yesterday. Here's how they did. Coming up this Sunday, get ready for dazzling ball handling tricks, high-flying slam dunks, and hilarious family comedy at the fourth annual Slam Dunks for Our School event to benefit the DARE Education Foundation. Come out to First Flight High School at the gym on Sunday at 4 p.m. Doors will open at 3.30. The Los Angeles Flight Squad will take on the OBX Scallywax. Tickets are on sale at the door and at the State Credit Union here in Manteo. Time for another Throwback Thursday as we look at some juniors from their Manio Elementary School days. I want Dr. Pepper. Ah. Thanks. Cool. Drink um, Dr. Pepper. Drink it today. Then what we have for dinner tonight? I have salad. No, can we have smart ones? I'll go check in the refrigerator. We have them. Can I? Oh, these are good. Can we have them tomorrow night? Yes, we can. Smart ones. You gotta have them. Buy smart ones. Big baker's mess. Give me a cake. Dad! You, did you get Dr. Pepper? Yes, why would I not? I love Dr. Pepper. There's nothing better than Dr. Pepper. True. It fills your thirst. No, it like goes your drinks like cranberry juice or something like that. The almonds? No, sorry, they were all out. Mom, Mom, did you get the almonds? No, sorry, they were all out. But I did get the raisin bran. But they're, they're not, not the same. same. Sorry, you will eat the raisin bran. Mom, I want the almonds. Sorry, they were all out. Please try the raisin bran. Okay. We love the raisin bran. You gotta have some. Now let's check in with Mrs. Gale and find out what you got cooking in the kitchen today. Here's what's cooking today. We have pepperoni pizza, corn dog nuggets, steamed cabbage, sweet potato waffle fries, and peaches. Thanks, Miss Gale. That's Manio today. For Janae Julian, I'm Kelsey Sexton. And I'm Warren Brown. Have, have a great weekend. weekend.